what's up guys this is IAF and today we are here for the review of the game Need for Speed Most Wanted this was quite a weighted game on the iOS platform but I know it was it has been out for a while but I was kind of waiting for the oops special Christmas discount so uh, this game was actually for six dollars ninety nine cents but I got it just for ninety nine cents so this was really cool nope I got it for free yes I did get it for free if you wanna check that out how to get it for free once again nope uh, if you wanna check that out I'll have the links in the description so let's talk about the game Need for Speed Most Wanted uh, many of you should or could have played it on your uh, PC or Mac whatever the version of PC or Mac was released quite some time ago but uh, I was really tempted to get this game on my iPhone because I didn't actually get a chance to play it on my PC. So yeah, really cool game. Uh, I wouldn't say that these graphics are the best graphics you could ever see on the racing gaming platform on the iOS. But yeah, awesome graphics. Uh, you know, they quite do their work really cool. Uh, the controls are really simple. Um, as you can see right now, tilt to steer, swipe up for boost. Uh, like tip for drift like hold as you can see it's flashing right now right hand and side and turn for drift we have left for braking so yeah really cool graphics and uh, not talking much I'll let you enjoy the game the gameplay I mean enjoy So yeah, I would definitely say that this was the kind of very nice game I have ever played on the iOS platform. Of course, you are awarded uh, with uh, different kinds of stuff. That is the money, as you can see in here, the money and uh, the um, something milestone reach. But you actually get something called reputation, so with which you can unlock cars, buy more cars with the money you get, and uh, you can unlock more tracks. So that's really cool. And let's go ahead. Uh, this does show you your position. And uh, let's jump off to another one. So you get different cars to choose from. The only thing I missed from my Asphalt 7 uh, was renting the cars. Yes, I really loved renting cars, but what can I do actually? I'll purchase the car, buy a car. Yes, and yes, that's mine. You also get something to choose from, like only the colors and the hood changes, but no more customizations, clumsy customizations. <laughs> As you can see, it does show, you know, uh, your completion. So I'll rate this game first of all, and then let you enjoy the game. Uh, according to the visual, I will rate this game from a scale of 0 to 10. Uh, yes, I would get, give it uh, 8 or 7.5 out of 10, because I really love the game. Really nice graphics and really awesome game. Nice controls. The only thing I miss is the multiplayer option. Yes, uh, it has got no multiplayer options. Plus, we do not have any, I mean... Uh, no multiplayer options and no free play yes no free play uh, you only get to race along the uh, you know races you cannot go for a free play which was uh, the best feature in the old iOS platforms I mean old need for speed games on the PC version so yeah really oops again no just get out I really love the game and uh, so guys enjoy Of course, any most wanted game cannot be completed without the police. Uh, so, while racing, you get the police to harass you and uh, you know get you back from other racers. But uh, you need to like take them down, like I did. 
the one thing I also liked about the game was uh, uh, like you need not do any drifting or that the uh, nitros or the nitros boost keeps on increasing by itself on continuous time intervals so that's really cool Yeah, that was something on the gameplay option. If you like the review, hit the like button down there. Or if you want to get some awesome updates, hit the subscribe button down there. Thanks guys for watching this video and I will definitely see you in the next one. Namaste.